Let's Tell me when. Marking. You like that, eh, Zong? You didn't think I knew about that. <clears throat> we start? Wait, when do we start? Yeah, no. Yeah. Hi, guys. Welcome to the Really Good Podcast um, with your host, Bobby Althoff. Today, I'm here with... Can you introduce yourself? Drake. That's not your name. It, that is my middle name. Yeah. That's not your real name. That's my government name, middle name. Why would you go by that? What's your first name? My first name is Aubrey. Mm -hmm. I see where you go with that. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, my, I think my mom named me after a lawyer, which always kind of like rubbed me the wrong way. Because like, I don't know, why would you just name me after like a, a random lawyer unless like there was something else going on, you know? I was named after a cheerleader my dad thought was hot. Really? Mm hmm Yeah. Bobby? Yeah. It's an older name. My dad's old. Okay, but like for a fact, like you've seen the girl or that's yeah, just Yeah, he showed story? me. No, he showed me the yearbook. Oh. Yeah. What year? I don't know. <laughs> I'm just asking. It's like this is that, my that, that sounds like a good like a mm -hmm. good like excuse like or like a story like, oh, yeah, I named you after a really hot cheerleader yeah. named Bobby. That was a, a hot <laughs> Topic for my mar my family's marriage. My mom didn't like that very much. Yeah, no, yeah. It definitely sounds a little. Like... He, but my other alternative name was Larry, L A R I. He thought it's really cute. If he's watching this right now, he'd tell you he thinks that's a really cute name. He stands by it to this day. Do you like that name, Larry? I just think... girl. If I said hi, my name is Larry. What would you say? I just think that there's maybe a deeper conversation to be had within the family. Okay. Like the two options were Bobby and Larry. Yeah. And then just like slap an eye on the end and make it feminine. Mm hmm Your name is Aubrey. Yeah. So don't. But like there's nothing. Okay. Yeah. But my mom named me Aubrey, a guy's name. That's Aubrey's not a guy's name. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Yes, it Have is. Have you ever met a male Aubrey? Yeah, you're looking at him. So, yeah, I met myself. It's like, you what? don't even go by that because it's such a bad name. No, that's not true. It's just like... Why do you go by Drake? Because it's shorter. You know, t people with two syllables are way less successful than people with one. Sorry. Larry. I go by Bob. <laughs> that's crazy. Okay, Aubrey. That's crazy. Aubrey. Yeah. Um, don't. Yeah. What are you looking at? I don't know. Yeah. Don't do that. <laughs> I have ahead, a tattoo on my hand. Yeah. I was just like thinking about it because it's just. <laughs> Can you not drink during my interview, please? Why? Because that's inappropriate. It's like a nightcap. Okay, that's not like it. That's sad. <laughs> Why? Get a real nightcap. I'm working hard. I'm I'm here like my life is stressful right now. Okay. I'm sitting here right now with sweatpants on. Yeah. My hair tied back. My hair is tied back, sorry. And I have no makeup on. I see. I, I get I get where you went. I get like I understand the journey you were trying to go on with that. Clearly, like you Does obviously Does that make you feel any type of way? Well, I mean you look great. But I feel like you're just kind of like forcing like a rap. Forcing a rap? Like forcing like like kind of like for us to like meet in the middle on some like rap metaphor. Okay. But because <laughs> it's written on your hand. Would you spin by me? Spin by you? Mm -hmm. Would you spin? Could you spin by me? It's kind of washing off now. <laughs> so I don't know what I was going to say. Dude, that was something you rapped once upon a time. Um. Well, like. Yeah, so I guess, I don't know whoever related to you, probably mm -hmm. like a little typo, but would I spin about you? Yeah. What do you think that means? I have no idea what. But like, take spin, like. Would you spin? What does spin mean? Why would you say that? Would you spin about me? Yeah, what do you think it means? Would you sing a song about me, maybe? <laughs> Why is that funny? Because <laughs> like, how how is that possibly? Would you spin? Like you spin oh, a little like. Oh, like a like, record? Yeah. Would you spin? Yeah, a I guess if this was like 1954, that would be like. What else would a spin mean? Spinning is like, like, I would like, 
go around someone else and like do something to them for you. Like I'd spin there. Did you make that up? I know I didn't know. Never heard that before. I mean, like, yeah, I wouldn't peg you to like hang out in the trenches of like Atlanta. So I wouldn't. Did you hang out in the trenches of Atlanta? I do sometimes, yeah. Still? Sometimes. And you spin about people? Like, if like somebody like was, I don't know, like violated you, like would I go do something to them? Maybe, yeah. Depends on how close we get. Will you spin? Would you like expect your man to like spin for you? No, I really don't want him to make music for me. No, it's not like I'm saying. Would you expect him to like defend you against another man? Not using the term "spin" by me. Why? It feels like he's just gonna make music for me with a record. So how would you want it worded? Would you protect me? Oh, okay. That's mm-hmm. really like, like, yeah, chivalrous and like kind of like. I feel like that's like from like some like Matthew McConaughey movie or something. Like, do you have you something against me? that? No. What type of movies do you watch? Um, I'm more of like a true crime. I like watching like murder documentaries and stuff. Why? I don't know. I just like like things that are true. Murder documentaries. Yeah, I don't know. They, There's yeah. other things that are true that are happy. <laughs> you're right. You're right. You're right. You're right, you're right. Um, yeah, I don't know. I I I can't really explain it. I think my dad, when I was younger, used to um, like. Uh, when I stay at his, his house, he would like watch America's Most Wanted, and he would like just like shake his foot, like like kind of do this thing with his foot. And then now I do it too. Like I sit and I watch like murder documentaries, and I just like kind of shake. It's my weirdly foot. descriptive. <laughs> I wasn't really looking for that. Okay, well, it was now. a vivid memory for me. So just shaking his leg. <laughs> I'm just letting you, you know. That like, that's why I associate Does it. Does it with come me. naturally to you, or do you just do it on purpose? I don't know. I think feel like it's like a visual visual thing from my past would you describe know. yourself as successful? what is your what does your dad do obviously we're keeping your dad's life a secret so yeah like what's what tell me something what does your dad do in his he like, builds houses your dad builds houses okay mm-hmm. and like what else like that's all he does okay yep um he is really yeah we don't really need to talk about him why i don't know well, you, you, I was just, I was like speaking on like a fond dad. memory. Well, it's um, not a fond memory. <laughs> I mean, he's watching like. Well, I've told this story before, but what? I'll tell it again. Well, he, he, he built, he did something for Snoop Dogg. Do you know him? Yeah, I do. Are you friends with him? He's my uncle. Really? Yeah. For real? You're not kidding right now? I mean, yeah. Like, he's like my OG, like my uncle. Like, like he's your like, actual uncle. Well, no, it's like... He's Why'd like, you call him your uncle? Because like that's like what like black people do. Like if he's if a guy's like friends with my dad, he's like my uncle. Okay. So that's he's cool. like an uncle to me. He's an uncle to you? Yeah. And your dad helped him at some point or something? Mm-hmm. He was working on his neighbor's house and then he worked on his house. And... Um, so he got like a referral? Yeah. From his neighbor? Mm-hmm. I think he'll what be year mad. was this? What what air? What was, Snoop era are we talking about? Like, are we talking about like rich Snoop Dogg or like when he was like? He lived in Diamond Bar. I don't even know what that is. He might still live there. Oh, okay. So like, yeah. So it's not. Uh, it's just like inland California. Okay. Yeah, he worked on it, and then he gave my dad his closet tours. Okay. He was just throwing them away, and we. I think my dad took them, and then we have them. And in like our, repurposed them or something. He just put them in our house. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Do you want them? No, not really. I mean, like, but Why? that's a cool memento. How I much guess. money do you have? A significant amount. How much? Guess. Could you buy me a Lamborghini right now? Yeah. And, like, not think about it. It wouldn't hurt you financially if you just bought me a Lamborghini. Yeah. Will you do that? And we'll see where it goes. I don't really want a Lamborghini. I know. I can't it's really. Not what, what's your dream car? Um, hmm. Probably like a Honda. What's your dream car? Hmm. Like if you had an aspirational goal. Yeah. For yourself. Mm-hmm. What's your dream car? Hmm. Like. Well, my dream would be to not have to drive a car. So someone, my dream, can I have one of your drivers? No, but like, 
Okay, but if you, like for you, mm-hmm. like in your life, oh, so you'd want a driver then? Yeah. But what would he drive or she drive? Just would you have a female it, driver? Yeah. Probably. That'd be like kind of. Do you, why, do you have any female drivers? I don't. Now it sounds mm-hmm. really like, discrim- like, like, I'm like, I'm not discriminating. I just don't, I, I don't, I haven't. Okay. I don't really hire, like. The, yeah, who hires them for you? But my main driver. Your main driver? Yeah, would like a, then assemble kind of like a yeah, group Yeah, you should of tell drivers. him to assemble some females. I should, I should. Yeah. So what would you do? Do like a all, oh. What is that? <laughs> what does that sound? Why are you know. looking that way? With Sebastian, I think. Can you stop doing that? What? No, it was Sebastian. Stop do- talking about people. No, that's my dog. Stop talking about dogs. That's my guy, though. You have a pet dog? I have two. Do you? I don't see any. No, they're not here. We're, by the Why'd way, you call him that? We're in a locker room right now, so obviously there's no dogs here. You just said that's my dog. Yeah, that's Sebastian. my boy. Like, Why'd you call him a dog? Because he's my friend. But you called him a dog. I know, but that's like what like hip people do in like 2023. Call people dogs? Yeah, like, yo, that's it's my dog. Like, nice. I'd be like, yo, you're my dog. Like, if I see you out after this. You're going to call me a dog. Uh, yeah, I would be like, yo, Bobby's my dog. My dog. Yeah. I don't like that. What would you, okay, what would you prefer to be called if I, if I was to mm. reference you as my friend? Hello. Feel free. Why? What's in that? Like, passion fruit juice and watermelon juice and tequila. It's a really fruity drink. I know. Okay. Yeah, I know. Sounds familiar, right? I'm sure like, you probably see this a lot at home, right? No. Because. Why do you like fruity drinks? <laughs> um, they're refreshing. Try it. What side did you drink out of? I haven't, t- haven't tasted. Oh, that was a lie. I had to take a sip. Yeah, what side? I don't know. Just look for my like lip mark or something. Probably this side, right? I mean, you should go same side so we can bond. No. You went same side anyway. I tricked you. Uh-huh. No, you didn't. I saw it. No. Nope. And I was watching you. I'll go same side of you right now. Okay. I have COVID. Nothing you can do about it. I have COVID. It doesn't exist anymore. Are you going on tour soon? I'm actually um, going on tour in like four or five days. That's why we're like sleeping in the middle of an arena right now in Memphis, Tennessee. Why do you want to do it here? I didn't really have a choice. Why? You kind of like really were super excited and like forceful. So I just tried to like make it work. And it's three in the morning. I had to go to sleep soon. What time do you go to bed normally? About like 6.30 a.m. Oh, it's a good time. Yeah. What time do you wake up? Like 2.30 p.m. Mm-hmm. Why didn't you text me back when I texted you at 3 o'clock and I asked you why you wouldn't film a podcast with me? I did. I always hit you back. Mm-mm. That's how we got here. No, you didn't reply to me. I text you when I'm going to bed and then you see it when you wake no. up. And I'm asleep. I texted you one time at three o'clock and you didn't reply. At what, in the morning? Yeah, why'd you follow me on Instagram? Um, I don't know, you just remind me of people that I like. Mm-hmm. You know? Why do you follow so many people on Instagram? I don't really. It's a lot of people. I don't. Do you know 3,000 people? Do I have 3,000 followers? Or? You follow 3,000 people. Go ahead. I won't look. Oh. Oh wow. Yeah, it's kind of embarrassing. How, well, how many people do you follow? Three hundred and something. Yeah, it's all relative, right? Yeah. Wow, you have a lot of followers. Not really. I yeah, you do. No. 620,000 people like care what you... It's not a lot compared to you. Okay, well. Yeah. You know, like I said, it's all relative, but 620,000 is still really good. That's a yeah. lot of people. How do you feel like 
like how do you feel about that because remember you told me that you were really jealous of somebody back in the day that had followers and then, yeah and then um like how do you feel now that you've obviously just crushed that person's existence i feel like i wish i had the amount of followers that you had okay but you have a like, lot of followers what about being grateful for what you have like how do you feel about i'm grateful for what i have but my goal is to be bigger than you one day oh okay do you think that will happen huh do you think i can be how'd you get so big mm, i don't really why do you know. think people like you i don't know i don't i do not know when do you learn how to walk what when do you learn how to walk when you in a wheelchair Oh, oh, oh. Um, okay, what, I, you're firing off questions without answers. When what did you was learn the first, how to walk? When I learned how to walk? Probably when I was like, no. I don't know, like six months or something. You went from being in a wheelchair to walking. I saw I you walk in here. It was an acting. I was on TV at one point. On a TV show. You portrayed someone who sits in a wheelchair and you don't sit in a wheelchair yourself. Yeah, but like um yeah mm -hmm. but obviously like it's acting you know mm. what else you want to talk about what if you could if you could hook me up with anyone who would it be like who would you see me being with who would i see you being with yeah if you could like like link me up with anyone who would it be beyonce okay Someone else, because Beyonce is married. Why do you know that? You follow her closely? <laughs> Everyone in the world okay. knows that. She's married to? Jay-Z. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. Brushed up on your facts before this one, eh? Yeah, I did. Okay, pick someone else. It doesn't have to be someone famous. It could be like... It that be, does. Uh, why? You're not going to marry someone that's not famous, Of course. I, I, I probably will end up marrying somebody that's not famous. Famous people really aren't that... Like, aren't that anything? They're not that intriguing. They're you're not, not that, that anything. Huh? You're, you're not that anything or that intriguing. No, I'm an anomaly. Did you have trouble saying that word? <laughs> I don't know why I did. Try it again. I'm an anomaly. Good job. I didn't want to overpronounce it like that either. <clears throat> I'm an anomaly. I'm not gonna cut out you saying that wrong <laughs> three times. Yeah, but okay. Yeah, Jennifer Lawrence. Thank you ah. for the drink. She's fire. Fire? Yeah, she's like, she's, she's a, she's a. Do you think I'm a cup holder? No, I was giving you something to drink. Like, have another sip. Let's get, I want you to get in your bag. My bag? Get in your bag. What's that? Like, get you, like, in your zone. In your bag? In your bag, yeah. You can take that one with you on, on the road that is life. Just be like, anytime you're you like... You say a lot of things that don't make sense. <laughs> I guess if you... So Jennifer Lawrence like, is fire? Do you like... What's your situation? Who do you see yourself being like, with? Does what someone celebrity? lock away your phone? Are what? you not allowed to like look at like current oh, events or something? I don't current know. I'm events. saying like things that like are, everyone else is pretty privy to. Seems like you're privy. kind of... Privy. Like, that was a big word. It's not. It's like it's a big word. five letters. You know what I mean? <laughs> like it sounded big yeah who That's uses that word and privy yeah i've never heard anyone use that word before it's a good point yeah so don't use words like that okay are you gonna take it i'll just take it back what thank you what celebrity would you want to hook up with if you could anyone in the world that um, you haven't already hooked up with <laughs> um I, I don't really have anybody like I don't have anybody on my... Because you hooked up with all of them? No, that's not why. I just, like, I'm not really, like, a celebrity chaser. Because you've hooked up with all of them well, already. That's not like, why. I there, just, like... they're done not. that. If I could hook you up with anyone, it would be my dog, Smigs. Smigs? Smigs. Smiley. Is that a... I'd hook you up with Smiley. Can you tell me about Smiley? Let me show you a picture of him. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Why would you hook me up with him? I just feel like you need a little Smigs in your life. Smigs? Is he well known or are you just a friend of yours? I mean, yeah, he's pretty well known in my city and like pretty much like like throughout like the world, but like not like like you you wouldn't know him because like you obviously like had trouble like remembering who Beyonce was married to. So 
I didn't have trouble. You hesitated for a second. No, you were proud of me because I knew. Like, that's Megs. That's who you want me to marry? Yeah. Any, any, like. Does he do anything? He talks like, Bobby. Like, yo, Bobby, you have to go to. You have to go to garden and get me a general towel, Bobby. That's how he talks. That's really nice. Yeah. He's, he's like, it's like, uh, you know, you need that in your life. I feel like you need to spice things up, B. With smigs. Yeah. You and Are you smigs. covering your phone in case you get messages that you don't want to see? No, not really. I let the world see. My cousin just called me. That's about it. And my mm-hmm. mom. I'm sure. So. Yeah. But yeah, you and smigs would be a hit. Yeah, you, you really should tried interview to Smigs get over that maybe. really fast so you could hide the messages you're receiving. I got nothing to hide from you. You do. Have you ever gone through someone's phone? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. What prompted that? I wanted to know what was on their phone. Oh. Well, like, you, you've never gone through someone's phone before? I think like, yeah, maybe. When? When's the last time you did it? Years ago. How long ago? Years ago. How long ago? Like, I don't know. Whose was ago. it? A girl that I was talking to that I knew. You went through her phone? Did thought, you find anything? Kind of, yeah. What'd you find? Um... She took a she took a guy to get his to get his car cleaned. Did you write a song about her after? Um, no, not about that. But do you write songs about people? Yeah, I do. But not about her. No, it was it was that wasn't really that. It, I've had things hit a little harder than that, but but I did think something was up, and then that day she she did go with someone to get get his car clean. That doesn't. That feels kind of innocent. I know it sounds. <laughs> That doesn't sound too crazy. No, I'm <laughs> saying like it sounds like it, nah, it makes me sound crazy. Like yeah, you did. Yeah, maybe there's more to the story. I just don't song. want her to watch this and then be like, oh, and then you, you know. But like, yeah, it started with that. I'm you on know? her side. Clearly, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that really did sound like I didn't find shit. So she went to get her car washed. <laughs> like no, she she like w- went with the guy and like helped him like wash his car. You know. Oh. I know it's just bad. Yeah. I'm sorry that happened to you. <laughs> I'm really sorry. I hope that. Yeah. I hope that you can recover. What did you find? Oh, he was cheating on me. Oh yeah. shit! <laughs> it's a lot worse than what you went through. Why do you think you get cheated on? Um, I don't think he liked me. But like, where where do you think the void was? The void. Yeah, like where are you? He was just like. Ew, her name is Bobby. Why would I be with her? Probably. No, you're 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 hot. Like I don't. I'm not like like I just mean like I was just like a confidence booster. <laughs> like you're like you're attractive. So it's obviously not like you don't have to play shy. Like ew, Bobby. Like I just mean like what do you think? Like what do you think? Not makes men cheat, but like in your personal like um, situation, what do you think? What do you think? He, why do you think he cheated? Yeah, I don't know. You wrote a book? (laughs) I did write a book, yeah. One line per page. Quick read. I read it while I was waiting for you. Really? Yeah. What do you think? That my my therapist told me I need to stop listening to what people tell me. But? But You finish it. But if... Wow. If I listen to... No, but... Yeah, something about yeah. If I finished your book, be listening to, did you even write this? <laughs> I did. I did. I just did you have like, a don't ghostwriter for your. This is like twelve words. <laughs> you had a ghostwriter. No. Who wrote it? I wrote it with a friend of mine. Did you, the friend write that page? Uh, no, we wrote it together. Well, you don't remember how that ended. Okay, I don't like. remember every word of the book verbatim. I'm sorry. Rather us than love. Imagine me trying to front on this free app okay i don't like this page okay obviously because it has like urban jargon on it that like intimidates you imagine me trying to front on this free app um fuck i look like (laughs) posted up feeling like they're real life i remember that one we all came up broke i'm the only one that used my tools to fix it what but um, okay sorry like i forgot like okay we don't have to read every page like some trivia i thing. wouldn't do that if i were you literally 
partner up. Settle down. It's greater than settle. Okay. Good job. <laughs> oh, yeah. You're Aubrey. Done now. Okay. That sounds good. Why'd you write that? Why'd you get married? Because why not? Why didn't why you get married? Why did people married? get married? Why didn't you get married? Um, I don't know. It seems like, like, not too, like, I don't know. It seems like a thing of, like, ancient times or something. Maybe. You're never going to get married. You just said that earlier. You said you were going to get married to someone who wasn't famous earlier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I, I, I think I will there. eventually. You asked me why Why haven't I gotten married? Yeah. The truth? Yeah. I don't know. I don't think I can offer somebody what they'd be looking for right why? now. It, just consistency. I think my life, just, my work is my priority. Mm -hmm. So then I, I don't, I wouldn't want to, I wouldn't want to not be able to sleep around <laughs> contribute as a partner sleep around don't lie we know what people glimpse do. into what your relationship is like That's judgy not, not judge even. larry don't call me larry um so you don't want to get married because you want to sleep around well no i don't want to get married because like i just don't want to disappoint someone and like i'm not like amish what do you have against Amish people? I don't. It's just like I needed to, something to rebuttal the fact that you're saying that I'm basically like a thought. You are. Oh, you know what a thought is. I've heard that word. Yeah? Mm-hmm. How do you spell it? T-H-O-U-G-H-T. That's not how you spell it. That's how you like spell. Thought. Thought. Like, thought. Not, not like. You a thought. Has anyone ever called Why'd you a you thought? No. You a thought, Bobby. Are you calling me that right now? Kind of, yeah. <laughs> you a little thoughty, Bobby. What does that mean? <laughs> it's just fun saying it to you because like, you don't really get offended by it because you don't even really know what it means. So I can just say it to you. and like, I've never really been able to just look at someone and say that to their face. Thank you for that compliment, Aubrey. No problem. Do you like when people call you Aubrey? Um, if it's like, if it's genuine, some people will be like, like if you were like, if you were like, oh, I interviewed Drake the other day. And then like, like a girl that's like met me a few times. We're like, oh, Aubrey. Right. You don't like that. I just feel like it's like used to like, be like, oh, Aubrey or my mom. Mm-hmm also like has like a kind of like vocal tone to my name that reminds me of like being scolded too like Aubrey Aubrey did she call you Drake no Obs Obs that's even more feminine I don't think we should get into the whole name game again because I feel like it's just it's a slippery slope Obs. for you I feel like it's that's I'm owning that my name is embarrassing. You're not owning that. I don't think it's though. about your name. I just think it's about the fact that there were options. Yeah. It just, it gets, you know. How long I have you been questions. doing this? Sorry, what? How long have you been doing this? What? Your career. <laughs> Singing. Oh. Uh, Do you consider yourself a rapper or a singer? Um, I consider myself. I don't know, musician. Is that because you're bad at rapping? <clears throat> Do you think I'm bad at rapping? I've never What's heard your you. favorite? What? Mm. You've never heard what? Maybe on the radio, your music. What? what Any is, of your music. Okay, so, do, like, you've never heard, you were going to say you've never Any heard of your music? Drake music. song? No. Ever. Not that you I can never think never heard a Drake song. Can you sing one? No, but like I'm just asking you, like, are you gonna be one of like those people? That's like, I, I've never heard heard you before. Not that I would recognize. Like, oh, what? that's Drake. Okay, like you've never heard like Kiki. Do you love me? Yeah, I've heard that. So then you, I wouldn't recognize that. that was you though. <laughs> what? Why do you think that was such a good sound? Like Kiki, who's Kiki? If it doesn't matter. The point is, like, you you would not know who sang that song. You would just be like, yeah, absolutely. You would 100%. be like, that could be like, no oh, idea. that yeah. could be like, if someone was like, oh, 
Have you ever heard Kiki Do You Love Me by like Tyga? Yeah. You would be like, you would fully be convinced. Absolutely. That there's no, okay. There's absolutely. What's your favorite Tyga song? Is he married to Kylie Jenner? Is that the guy that dated him? He dated <laughs> I mean, Kylie like, Jenner? I, like, yeah, maybe like before like the iPhone or something. <laughs> like that's such ancient Does gossip. he sing? Huh? He raps, he sings. Yeah, what's his, what's your favorite Tyga I don't, song? I don't know who that is. You want me to play you some Tyga right now? No. I'm about to. Okay. You're going to sit through this. The whole song? No, nah, just like a little snippet. Rack, rack, city bitch. Twenties on the titties, bitch. Let's get to the second hook at least. No, let him get to the second hook. Are you friends with him? Uh, yeah, yeah, we're cool. Did he send you that to huh? play? Did he send that to you? <laughs> no, it's out. It's uh, it's it's a released song. Mm, never heard it before. Rack city bitch, rack rack city bitch, rack city bitch, rack rack city bitch. Never. I don't listen to music. <laughs> You've heard rack city bitch for sure. That's like. Who's your profile picture on Instagram? Is that your dad? What? The person on your Instagram page. It's Little Wayne. Who's that? Stop this. Who's Little Wayne? Stop this. Can you play me a Little Wayne song? There's absolutely no way. I'm not. I refuse. If you don't know who it is, I will. I won't play it. I've heard his name. <laughs> I've heard his name. I just thought it was a picture of your dad. That's. It didn't okay. look like a picture of you. Does he looks like me? That guy looks like me. The guy. No, he didn't. That's why I thought it was your dad. <laughs> it's who? That's. What? I don't know. Wait, you wouldn't. What are you doing right now? What are you trying to do right now? I don't know. I just feel like it's like my dad versus your dad and like whatever. But like. What type of music do you listen to? Rack City, bitch. That's what I listen to. What type of songs do you sing? Can you sing one, please? Like, what are my songs? Or play songs? a song from you. I told you, Kiki, do you love me? That's the go-to song that you would tell people <laughs> that you sing if people ask you. Someone That's my came deepest up to you. cut. Your deepest cut? Yeah. Like, like the, oh, that's the one. That's the one. Who's Kiki? That really broke the mold, you know? Is it about? That's the one that really broke the mold for me. Is it about somebody named Kiki? Uh, it was about somebody named not, not, that's like a nickname. What was her real name? Kiana. Did you just make that up? Nope, I didn't. You wrote a song about her? Yeah. Do you still feel sad when you think about her? Um, It was more like, it was more almost like a joke at the time. Like, Does she love you? No, I don't think so. I'm sure she's like fond of me, but like it was just more like, she, I think she had made a comment like, oh, like you'll never like write a song about me. Mm -hmm. And then I was just like, watch this. And then it made you a lot of money. It did well. Do you like having a lot of money? I think that it makes life easier. How much money means nothing to you? Like, What's an amount that you can just hand out and you're just like a no biggie? I don't know. I feel like I'm, I don't want to be, I don't want to sound. Oh my gosh, it's that much. Okay, whatever the number is, can you give it to me? Sure. You can? Yeah. I'll get it for you right now. Do you keep cash on you? Yeah. Why? For moments like this. When, when some super, like, semi-condescending, but kind of kind, like, How much money do you have in here? comes up to me and she's like, can I get 
like whatever sum of money you're willing to part with. And I'm just like, yeah, sure, why not? Thank you. <laughs> That's what I keep it for. You don't have to make this about race. I know. I'm sorry. I don't know. I just didn't know what else to say mm -hmm. right there. Thank you for saying that. But like your, yeah. Your yeah? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. If you had to write me a song right now, what would you do? What would you sing? What would I name it? No, sing the song that you wrote about me right now. Write me a song in your head right now. Like, All right. I'd say... Like, uh, no, stop, stop talking and start thinking. <laughs> okay, I'm trying. No, stop talking and start thinking. I'd be like... Mm -hmm. um, I'd be like... Bobby, Bobby, people will probably think that I'm singing about a guy. Bobby, Bobby, people will probably think that I'm singing about a guy Cause you were almost also named Larry And that, I, that's as, as far as I got so far Keep going, please <laughs> Oh, okay I don't really have much past that. I don't know anything else about you, really. Okay. Well, once you get to know me, will you write me a song? I will. And then dedicate a whole album to me, please. Okay. I'll, I'll send you a song. I'll write you a song. I'll actually write you a song, like a sweet song. A sweet song? Yeah, yeah. Has any guy ever wrote you a song? No. What's the nicest thing a guy's ever done for you? Um... Rough life. I'm trying to think. Oh, okay. I hope I hope it's because there's too many nice things. Yeah. Buy me flowers. Oh, that's sweet. Yeah. What's well, the nicest thing? Textbook. Thing yeah. Textbook. Well, you know, normal people get flowers. No, I, yeah, no, I'm, what, I'm not. What's the nicest thing a girl's ever done for you? <sighs> nicest thing a girl's ever mm -hmm. done for me. I had a girl that made me a really nice leather bound book of like memories and stuff that I probably would have, still have it? forgotten. Yeah. She just, she made me a leather bound book. And you have it? Yeah. Yeah. I still have it. Yeah. You're never going to get rid of it? I, I hope not. I don't know, unless like I lose it in fire or something. Well, that was nice of her. What's the most amount of money you've ever been handed? In what? I don't know. Just like someone gave you money. Cash? I don't for a deal or anything. <laughs> Stop this. I can't you can't answer that? No, not really. For a deal or like I like that's Yeah. No, 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 I can't. Do you wanna like rephrase the question? Yeah. Why is my mic bouncing? Because your you're moving yours and you're moving a lot, like your dad. What? You said your dad bounces. Oh, oh. And you bounce a lot too. You should learn how to stay still a little bit more. Like just stop moving and then it will stop moving. Please don't make fun of the microphones I brought. Are you making fun of the microphones I brought? No. Nope. I'm just like trying to like I'm just, I'm just my, trying to like have I'm a in my bag here in yours. Yeah. Right? Yeah. What are your friends gonna think when you go home and you're like, guys, I'm in my bag? Say it. Guys, I'm in my what? Guys, I'm in my bag right now. What does that mean? Just say it. Guys, I'm I'm scared too. No, it's not like it's not gonna get you in trouble. Say it. Guys, I'm in my bag right now. <laughs> what does that mean? It's funny you say it. What does that mean? No, it's nothing really bad. It's just say it again. I will not be doing that. Please, please, please. Guys, say I'm it. in my Say it again, say it no. again. What size please. shoe are you? Huh? What size shoe are you? Twelve. Is that big or little? I don't know. What do guys wear in shoes? I don't know. Which, like... Sounds small. Okay. What? What's... <laughs> what's what? your favorite color? Ugh, I never have a rebuttal to... What's your favorite color? Baby blue. What? It's a bad color. What's your favorite color? Yellow. That's a good color. Yeah. Does your shirt say African Canadian? What do you mean? African Canadian what? 
Heritage Association. <laughs> it was a gift. From who? My friend. What's what's their name? Ashley. <laughs> what's wrong with that? She just told me to put it on. Do you wrap things that get you in trouble ever? Mm-hmm. Do you do it on purpose? Well, I try not to. I try not to. I don't want to offend anybody, but you know, sometimes you just got to pop your shit, you know? Why do you say things like that? <laughs> what? Pop your shit. Say what does it. that mean? I said it. But like, say it in a sentence. Say what I said. I don't know what it means. Can you tell me what it means? Be like, yo, sometimes I got to pop my shit. I'm not going to say that. Why? Because I'll probably get in trouble. No, it's not. It just means like, sometimes you got to, you know, talk that talk. How much longer do we have left? <laughs> it's your podcast. Or How much longer until you have to What's go? it called? It's We're called Really Good? It's a really good podcast. The Really Good Podcast. Yeah. That's cool. What else do you want to know? Are you going to come see one of my shows? I'll do, I'll, when I perform Kiki, do you love me? I'll like, I'll, I'll like, wink at you. You won't even be able to see me. No. Nah. How about I will come to one of your shows if instead of saying Kiki, do you love me? You'll say Bobby, do you love me? Again, it's just it's pushing the boundaries on something that could be misinterpreted, like on my end. Just say it during your show. But then people are gonna be like, like which which guy is he? Oh, singing about? Yeah, I get it. Uh, maybe takes my like, song yeah. out of context. Yeah, uh, maybe. They're not going to be like, oh, it's got to be the Bobby with the eye. Yeah. Say Bobby with an eye. Do you love me? <laughs> Say Bobby with an with eye. eye. Do you love me? Yeah. I'll try and fit it all in. Then I'll come to one of your shows. Are you inviting me to one of your shows? Yeah, I'd love it. Am I your type? Um, I'd do it. Thank you. <laughs> like, I, yeah, like I'd do it. There's, you, you Not got, an it. <laughs> I know. I just went like, I, I like. You do it. <laughs> I asked him your type, and you said I do it. <laughs> it's not funny. What's your type? Describe it. Um. Just, just somebody like that's an individual. Like wow. In, in, <laughs> You really have high standards. For Individualism. Yourself. Like I like somebody that's like their own. They're not just like a carbon copy of like a person that I've seen a bunch of times throughout my existence. I like somebody with like a sense of humor, you mm -hmm. know? I like I don't know, like I'm asking cosplay. you to just physically what? what do you want them to dress up as? No, I no, I don't need them. Like, I just, I like, probably like, will fuck with them more if they like are into cosplay. Not with me, just like generally. Like, I just like, you know, if they're weirder like, than I thought you were. <laughs> that's a fact for sure. You got no idea, honey. Honey, are you like a sixty-year-old man? <laughs> honey, you use that word seriously? <laughs> I just. Maybe it's a. Maybe it's that. It's making you say honey. You should stop saying that word. You never know. Can you sweet, physically sweet attract? Cheeks? Can you? Oh, I would never say that out loud. That's you like just really did. chauvinistic or something. Physically, what is your favorite type of? What's your type? Describe your type. I I I'm I appreciate beauty in many forms you are so desperate <laughs> just anyone i just appreciate beauty in many human. forms like animals too no well. like just like obviously i like i like women that you know all of them just every, every captivating single, every woman present themselves yeah. in a way that is intriguing and unique what's your type um my type yeah um, that's a hard question, Why? and I can't answer it. My type. Why? What's your type? Just men with a lot of money. 
Tatsu? Yeah. So I'm your type? Um, no, more money than you. Oh, okay. Yeah, a little more than you. Definitely more than you. Okay. A lot, a lot of money. Well, yeah. Okay, but what, aside from you, like, yeah. trying to leech someone's bank account, like, what what, what are you into? Money. Like, what, what really, like? Money, gifts. Um, I like jewelry. I like, are you looking for a list of things to buy me? No, I just wanted to know, like, what, like, what, what? What I'm attracted to. When you, yeah, when you yeah. have your eyes. Mostly what type of car they're driving. Okay. Um, mm -hmm. If they have any jewelry on, how much it's worth. Would you ever get a BBL? No. Why not? What do you mean? That's a surgery. Yeah. Are you attracted to women who get those? No, I was just asking if you could get it. I just, I'm not going to get that. No? No. You wouldn't just like pop out with just a crazy wham Absolutely ski? not. It's like a... I already have one. Really? I'm already really like. You can't. I'm really I'm not skinny. I think skinny is attractive. I'm not. What's your best feature? Um. I have a really really big butt. No, I'm so serious and don't laugh at that. Really? Yeah. Thick, thickiana. No, my name is Bobby. Tikiana. Don't call me that. It's Why? Um, but that's my best attraction. What's really? your best trait? The you cakes? Do? You have you have the cakes? I don't call them that. Oh. Uh, do you have an OnlyFans? No. Well, I don't know. You said you have a crazy big butt and like you I want money. I, I want like, money. Okay. I'm more than just my butt. Okay. Yeah. You just were painting yourself out to be like like the, I just I all I'm you asked me about my ideal man was and I just said he was very wealthy. Okay. Very and then you were wealthy. like, I have a huge ass, and then I was like, You okay. asked me what my best trait was, and I was just answering. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. But is your ass like bigger than like? Is it like? Has it been something that you've dealt with your whole life? Like people being like, Wow. Yes, like, all the time. Crazy. It's been so awful, and I, I might actually get it reduced at some point because it's been so awful, and okay. everyone that's all they care about me for. Sucks. That's tough. Yeah. It's kind of like fame. Yeah. You with the ass, me with the fame. Yeah, you're... That can be the title of our joint book. You want to write a book with me? Sure. Okay. Do you consider yourself famous? I think so, yeah. At what level do you, is it okay for you to say that? Like, oh, I'm famous. <laughs> because I would not say that, but I'm not famous. You, you could say that. You're pretty... You're getting no. there. 600K. Left that left that girl in the dust. Six, Gone. Six hundred. Take 000. off, little Bobby. That's Six. when the mic starts agreeing. That's what it is. My mic's almost like agreeing with me. He laughed. He laughed at something I said. That was crazy. Wow, you told a joke. I know. For once, that's funny. Um, what, what were we talking about? You, rich that, guys, cars, BBLs. Do you think it's unattractive when women just want you for your money? Um, yeah, yeah, I don't, I don't want, I don't want, I want someone to... Can you hold your mic so it's like <laughs> No, my mic is, my mic is, my mic is like kind of like my like sidekick in this, in this interview. My mic's like, whenever I know I'm saying the right thing, my mic's like, yeah, yeah. That's my mic's like almost like, you know? Um, yes, I don't want someone to just like me for my money. That's my answer. Okay. What time is it, Bobby? This it's is time, insane. Don't do that. I'm just checking. It's three thirty in the morning. This is great. Can I have another drink? I'd love to get. Who are you saying that to? Just I don't know. I, Do usually there's who... someone there that like would okay get something for me, so I'm just used to that. But... Someone's really answering you right now. Yeah, I know. What a guy. Are you gonna say please with your? Can I have another drink? I I actually was just I just was saying it to the room. I didn't think someone was actually gonna get it for me. Well, now that you see someone's gonna get it for you, don't well, you think you should he, have if, him if he brings it? I don't he's know. He's going over there. He could have just left. Say please. I, he's not even in the room anymore. When he comes back, are you gonna say thank you? I'll think about it. Can you stop doing that? <laughs> uh, all right. It would be you got that. Yeah. All right. Ask me a couple more. Are you things. kicking me out? I'm just saying, like you know. I flew all the way here. 
You did. I really do appreciate it. On my daughter's that. first birthday. I wasn't going to bring that up. Mm-hmm. You missed your daughter's first birthday for To this. be here. Dark. Dark. Regret that you'll never be able to undo. Yeah. Horrible parenting. Where's your son? Somewhere safe, and it's not his birthday. When's his birthday? What does it matter? It ain't today, honey. Don't call me honey. So. I came here on my daughter's birthday because I thought I could get some good answers out of you. What's your daughter's name? Concrete. Concrete? Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah. It's a great name. My oldest is Richard. My brother, my brother's record label is called Concrete Boys. Oh, no way. Yeah. That's really cool. Yeah. That's really cool. Um, I'm going to send your daughter a voice note right now to your phone. Mm -hmm. She's one. Hey, Concrete. Uh, this is Jake just wishing you a happy birthday. Uh, guess things weren't set in stone. Mm -hmm. Right? For these plans. Because... Can you mom, send her some money? Mom missed it to come interview me. But later on in life, you'll hear this. And you'll know that hopefully this goes somewhere for her. Can you send her some money? And, and I'm going to send you How much? $100. Because that's what your mom said meant the most to her. Because I me. asked her. I said she could have anything for you. And she said that Please $100 her was that. the pinnacle of You better say thank money. you when you Happy birthday, Con. Don't call her con. <laughs> okay, I sent that. that to you. You can keep that. Thanks, Sebby. Appreciate it. Oh, and you just hand him your old one and you're not even going to say thank you for taking it. I, s I said thank you. Happy birthday, con. Right? It's okay. She's one. Thank you. She doesn't even know. Like, she doesn't Do you like even know her you're, name? you're her mom. Hmm? Do you like her name? Concrete? Yeah. It's a great name. What yeah. what made you think of it? Just wanted something unique. Yeah. So I named her Concrete. That's a, that's a, that's a yeah. hard name. You're so funny. <laughs> well, thank you for ruining my daughter's first birthday today. I hope this helps me in life. Um yeah, I hope this I hope this goes somewhere and Did you finish your song for me before we end this? No, I got to I got to I got to just try really, really quick. In. No, just think. Just stop talking like I asked you to do last time and think. Um, oh, I don't even remember where I left off, but I'd probably take it somewhere like, um, I'd probably take it there like, where I, I was like something like, Bo like, Bobby, you remind me of a guy. And then I was like, I'd be like, you're... Like you're the apple of someone's eye and like you missed the first one, but maybe you'll be there when she's five. <laughs> Something like Thank that. Thank you. <laughs> no problem. It's all good. What's on your nail? Hmm? What's on your nail? The Italian flag. Why? Because I was feeling Italian like a week and a half ago. Okay. Well, thank you, Aubrey. That's it? That's a note we're ending on? I don't know anything. Other questions? Okay. Do you have any other questions? Not for me? really, not really. It's probably probably best you skid out of home to be Are you mother of the buy year, me a right? Flight home. <laughs> Are you gonna buy me a flight home? I can do that. It's the least I could do. Can it be nonstop? Hmm. Nonstop. Is was that like a? Was that like a like the song? No. What song? The Drake song, nonstop. Do you think it's funny when you reference your own song? No, I thought people you, can use that word and it doesn't mean your song. <laughs> I just thought that you were ending the interview on a note where you were like, uh -huh. "Haha, I actually do know your songs." No, you were just asking. I don't for a know flight. your songs. Okay, all right. I got excited, but I was excited when you followed me on Instagram. I was really excited, actually. Really? Yeah. Like why? Just tell me why, and then we can go. Say something nice. What do you nice. mean? You have so many followers. Okay, but say something nice about, like, like you were excited because... Because so many people like you. And I was like, oh my God. So many people like you and you followed me. That's crazy. But then I realized you followed so many other people and I was like, oh, that's not that special. So I, the, I was like, okay. 
We should unfollow about three hundred. 3,000 people. So. But can you, all right, all right, but can we end it off? Like, say s- s- one thing, n- one nice thing. One yeah. nice thing about you? Yeah, just so like people. I like your un- hair. Thanks. You should <laughs> do this again sometime, said nobody ever to you. You can leave now. This is my room. I'm but. sleeping here tonight. <laughs> Good talk.